Gloria has been isolated from the outside world and this became her life even after the death of her novelist mother. She lives alone with her dog. <coughs> Authorities have no idea that there is still someone living in that isolated house in the forest. Grace, a high-spirited teen, comes to check on Claudia and makes sure she is doing okay after Claudia's mom passed away. Grace witnessed how Claudia's mom died in the lake. That is why investigators went to see and ask her questions. As Grace tries to look for someone around the house, she then saw Claudia's dog and finally met Claudia but seems she is so scared to see other people. I just wanted to make sure you're okay. How did you know I was here? But somehow, Grace was able to befriend Claudia. I'm Grace. Grace never treated Claudia like a stranger. She even showed Claudia how the outside world looks like. I saw what happened. I won't tell anyone. A pinky promise. Haven't you heard of a pinky promise? Grace taught her things that a teen like them should know. She assures Claudia she won't harm her and she's going to be her friend and would want to visit her often. What color are the others? Well, it's not that it's pink. It's just, it's just called your pinky finger. But Claudia tells Grace that no one should know about her since the police might take her away. Can I come and visit you sometime? No one can know I'm here. If they find out, they'll take me away. I won't tell anyone. Grace told the investigators that she only saw the lady and there's no other people when it happened. Yeah, look, I don't really think I saw a girl. No girl? No. Claudia still can see her mother as if she's talking with her and telling her everything will be okay. But Claudia seems to be traumatized of what happened since she saw her mother died in the lake. Grace tries to help Claudia overcome her fears. She even took care of Claudia and prepares her food. The two girls spend more time together and somehow made them feel attracted to each other. Right now. As Grace went home late, her stepfather asked her where she's been and she just told him she is with a friend. <laughs> Not like a... a boyfriend? The next morning, Grace went to see Claudia again and this time she brought candies and beads for them to make bracelets. Grace wanted to show Claudia how beautiful the outside world is despite what Claudia's mom told her. Somewhere. Anywhere. Grace was able to convince Claudia to overcome her fears as they both went for a swim in the lake. <laughs> Hey, 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 hey. Okay, breathe in, breathe in. Get out. Claudia doesn't want to be near the lake anymore since her mother's death, but Grace was there for her. Claudia opened up about what her mother has been telling her about the outside world and people being so cruel. That all the stuff my mom taught me in class about the world being cruel, about people being monsters. And that perception changed when she met Grace. Only like other monsters. Claudia now feels comfortable with Grace around. The two even spend their time inside Claudia's room and somehow feel the tension. Feel what? Your heart. But Claudia suddenly remembers her mother again and then told Grace to leave. I need you to go. Claudia, Claudia. I said go. But Grace did not give up and felt more inspired in helping Claudia. The investigators went inside Claudia's room and then saw her dog. Claudia hid and felt so terrified that they might see her and take her away. They took her dog, but good thing Grace saw them along the way and pretended that it was her dog. Tilly? You know this dog? Yeah. Yeah, I've been looking for her all morning. Claudia was so happy to see Grace again with her dog and told her how sorry she was and tells Grace not to leave her again. Please don't leave again. 
I want. Grace told Claudia that they will decorate her room for a change and Claudia feeling excited about it. They also spend time having breakfast and Claudia is so happy eating food that she never had before and tasted strawberry milk for the first time. Grace taught Claudia how to use makeup and somehow the two really felt the tension and started kissing. Did you give up? No. No, no, no. Do you want a hint? Yeah. And they both spent the night together and made love for the first time. I think I really like you. I think I really like you too. Grace went back home to get food, but the investigators were there and her mom was so upset knowing about Claudia. Grace has no choice but to tell them the truth about Claudia. Grace told them she can take care of Claudia, but it won't be possible since both of them are minors. 17 when you're a kid. Grace, listen to me. You cannot be her guardian. Okay, it's only as Claudia always grace, she has no idea that the investigators were there as well. Claudia was so scared and ran towards the lake and Grace ran after her. Fortunately, Grace was able to save Claudia from drowning and tells her everything will be okay and that she will never leave her. We're gonna be okay. Okay. I promise you. Want more queer content? then please subscribe and hit the notification bell.